Hey, it's Mark Ferguson with Investor More, and sorry my eyes are closed. It's very snowy and very bright out right now. And we're in front of the bar. So that's the bar that we bought a little while ago, and we have some exciting stuff going on. Um, it froze a little bit because the heat was turned off, so we'll talk about that. And we have some exciting things we found inside of it, and we have exciting things for the plans of the future bar and what we've done so far. So we will talk about all of that and why we bought it and that good stuff here coming up right now. And of course, check out investormore.com for much more information on our flips, rentals, being an agent, wholesaling, all that good stuff as well, and Amazon for our books. Here is the outside of the bar, which we have painted. Done a little work out here. We got some awesome snow for the wildfires, which are still going a little bit, so that's good to hear. Uh, we bought this bar for 132,500, which included the business and the building. And we've had a number of videos on it before. So we'll of course link to those. But the exciting news is over here, we took out a bunch of the ceiling and you can see the old cool light fixtures from who knows how long ago and some of the interesting stuff up there. So we're definitely gonna try and open up this ceiling. We'll probably keep some of the vent work and different things. But um, while we're doing that, we peeked up there and saw something very interesting and that is brick. So this whole wall may actually be brick. There was a window right there, but that could be brick. This wall here might be brick. We're thinking this front might be brick. And then the brick ends over here, kind of where the ceiling drops a little bit back there. So now we have to decide if we want to uh, pull all the paneling and plaster and have exposed brick or not, or not worry about it. So that's one of the exciting things. Um, the other exciting thing is, oh, this is closed up now. We had plans made for what we're gonna do. So seeing as how we have no idea what we're doing, we actually hired a bar consultant to uh, create a plan for us. So that's what the back bar will look like. A floor plan for what the inside will look like with the different seating and the new bar and how all that's gonna work. So we have a whole list of all the materials we need and everything that has to be done. And it's a little overwhelming and we're really happy that we hired this person because we have no clue what we're doing without them. So basically the plan would be to shorten this bar just a little bit and um, add tables and bench seating along the wall here, here, and here. And so that is our new plan. And of course we'll redo the bar back, redo this, which is just plywood. So um, we should have a really cool place once we're done, especially if we have exposed brick everywhere. I don't know how expensive that'll be, but that would be so cool. Um, the other really exciting news, which is not that exciting, is our contractor was here this morning and it was minus two here and uh, the bar heat was off. So apparently the thermostat wasn't working right. We have a brand new furnace we just put in and the heat was off and it's 57 out here now, but it was much, much colder than that before. And as you will see, it definitely caused some problems. So there's ice sticking out of the pipe. So we have at least one broken pipe, um, probably some other issues as well to deal with, with frozen pipes. And I think that is frozen in there. Um, so none of the alcohol froze. I think it freezes at a much higher temperature, but right now, um, some of the cool stuff we've got, the ceilings going away. We're having a brand new bar. We might have exposed brick. Now you can see this part's all cinder block. It was an addition. And then we'll also have frozen pipes to deal with. So hopefully those aren't too bad. You can see, um, there's quite a bit of pipes all around this back area and it's definitely much colder back here than it is in the front area. So we'll see how all that works. All right, so that is the update on the bar. Oh look, all kinds of crazy stuff up there. Tent, an awning, umbrellas. Eh. Keep finding new stuff all the time. I like that handy handsaw right there. So anyway, um, still working on this. It's been quite the process. We went in to get fingerprinted to get the liquor license transferred to us. Did all of that, turned it all in, have been waiting for a while, and then it turns out 
the town said, oh, you did it wrong. You're supposed to use our ID to do it. I'm like, okay, what's your ID? I'm like, well, we don't have it. We have to get one from the state. So now we're waiting for the town to get their ID so that we can go back and get fingerprinted the right way. So <laughs> it's been slow, but we couldn't really have gone much faster because of the process of transferring that and um, all the other things that have been going on at the wonderful bar. All right, so I'm on the patio now because it's a little less bright here than outside in the sun. Crazy bright with all the snow. Um, so that's the place, that's the bar. We're still working on it. Uh, it will take us a little while to get everything done. As you can see, there's a lot to do, a whole lot to set up. Uh, we could have just bought it and ran it as it was, but um, transferring the liquor license and all that would have taken some time too. And I think when we're done with it, it will be a really cool place, be much more valuable than we had it. So even if we end up running it and it's like, oh, this is a horrible idea, uh, we could still sell it, sell the business in the bar for much more than we had, or just rent it to a bar and keep the building as well. So that's the plan for now. Um, hope you guys enjoy these videos. If you like them, please hit the little like button. Uh, leave comments if you have any questions or things to add to what we've done. I uh, love seeing those. And welcome new subscribers as well. We'll have many more updates on this, our house flips, our other rental properties, and everything else going on here soon.